Welcome back. At the end of the previous part, we just defeated Chelka. Something tells me she isn't going to be happy about this. Wait. If I don't finish this now, I'll just be running forever. I have to take responsibility. It has to be me. I have to face her. Ah, uh, yeah, indeed. I'm sorry, Milm. I'll follow you. So please, forgive your sissy! Sissy? She's coming back, clearly. Oh. idiot no you can't have any mana left I mean I think it's definitely related to her eye because her eye is definitely closing <laughs> you're even stupider than you look a witch can absorb the mana around her and make as much magic as she wants as long as she has magic a witch is invincible, and there's nothing you little shits can do about it. If you want to kill me, you'd have to get rid of all the mana in the world. I'd like to see you try. We're on it. Impossible. Just a little more mana, and I'll have enough to kill you. I'm sorry, Milm. I couldn't save you. What? Heartbeat. What is this? There's something weird in my stomach. I thought we took the medicine for that. S stop it! What's happening? See, here's the question I have. It's like, clearly she was wearing different clothes before. When she transformed into Chelka. But why has she retained the clothes now? Sissy? How dare you take that form? Are you mocking me? I'm not gonna fall for it. Sissy, what's wrong? You're scaring me. Milm slowly placed her hand on a uh, Amelie, I can't remember how to say it. Quivering cheek. <sighs> it's warm. My hands are always warm. Yes, Milm. That's right. Uh, sissy, can't breathe. A call from Gabrielle? Hello, this is Amelie. Amelie, are you alright? What's the situation over there? Reasonably good, surprisingly. Um, well... Uh, all clear. Oh dear, oh dear. So, is that, is that it, chapter- Oh, we've done it! We've done it! Well done, everyone. Well done. Oh, tip 62? I know about the piñatas. I've already killed a few. Durga Castle Bedroom? of an angel those fat little cheeks I just want to rub my face on those chubby little cheeks okay a bit odd I mean, look at her face right now no I shouldn't Milm is tired she needs her rest maybe just a little oh dear no no Amelie fight it Fight the urge. I just have to focus on something else. Stop thinking about 
How cute Milm is! Right now, my face is very much the Hundred Knights. It's like, what is going on? Oh, but I lied to Gabrielle earlier. Maybe I had to, but I can't take it back now. The Vice Richer will never allow an awakened witch to go free. Shelka must be the witch that destroyed the rote branch. Milm's soul is still in there, but Chelka is in control. Only some of the time. I need to keep this hidden. I don't care if it's right or wrong. I'll do whatever I have to do to protect Milm. Car, you say? A raven? I've seen it before. This is the bird that Milm was feeding. <laughs> He's rubbing Milm's cheeks! Alright, steady on. No fair! I want some too! <sighs> so soft. Clearly not notice what's going on here, but you can see with her eye right there, it's more open this time. Stop! Gross! Indeed. M Milm? Why? Who you calling Milm? You need glasses or something? It's you, Chelka! Where's Milm? Where is she? Your sister is dead. How many times do I have to say it? No, Milm is alive! She was sleeping right next to me, right here! Leave! That body isn't yours! Give Milm back! Gah. Who throws a shoe, honestly? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you. Why did you fr- what? What? Uh, oh. Is this... blood? What did you do to me? What did I do to you? Didn't that hurt? It was a pretty hard hit. But what's hurt supposed to mean? You don't know what hurt means? You don't know what pain is? Pain? What's that? What? Well, um, you know, it's like a prickling, throbbing, sharp, unpleasant feeling. That's one version of pain. It's sort of like when you stub your toe, you get that sort of like... It, well, that's the thing. It's like she's described both at the same time. It's strange because there's, there's two sort of pain receptors going on. So you hit your toe on like, like a piece of furniture or something. You get that immediate sharp pain, so it pulls you away. And then comes the throbbing pain. Oh, I'm familiar with that. It's what I feel toward you. Ouch. Um, no, not that. I'm getting a call. From Gabrielle? Wait here. I'll be right back. Ow! A sudden pain ran through a Amelie. Yep. She inhaled sharply and grabbed her sides. Sweat gathered on her forehead. Getting kicked just now must have... I don't think my ribs are broken. They're just a bit bruised. Ugh, horrible timing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That woman was talking crazy. Milm is still alive. Alright, alright. And what was that pain stuff she went on about? It looks like there's a lot I still don't know. <laughs> Fine by me. I'll pound the unknown into submission. It's not exactly how that works, but okay. Ah, go, go, go! I, I, I get the point, Kaw. You're so loud. Shut off, you mangy bird. Caw, caw, caw! I mean, you're asking for it, aren't you? Hey, don't peck at me. You're so annoying. 
hundred knight! Chop this thing's head off and sell it to a butcher shop! Uh, gladly? Poku? I guess this stupid puppet isn't gonna follow my orders no matter what. Caw, caw, caw. Oh, dear. Whatever. Stupid crow! I'm gonna wring your neck if you keep cawing like that! Ah! Well, you're dead. Wait! Get back here! Stop flapping your damn wings around! Gah. I'll get you. Caw! You... you just insulted me, didn't you? Fine then. If that's the way it's gonna be, I'll blow you up along with this whole stupid castle! What are you doing? She's just gonna blow up the castle, it's fine, don't worry about it. Oh, perfect timing. You're going down too. No, you can't destroy this castle! This was the only home we had after we left our village. It's a ruin from the Great Witch War. People think it's cursed and don't come near it. And in here, we were safe from the demons. The Great Witch War? Hmm... We were starving, but we were safe. And Milne started smiling again. This is our home. It's precious to me. So please... I don't care about any of that crap. Everyone is just doing whatever they want and not listening to me. Wait, wait. Okay, I'll make you a deal. If you promise not to destroy this castle, I'll owe you one favor. I, I mean, it's, it's not a great plan, but all right. What? Do you want me to get a mana flower? Milm loved mana flower nectar, so I'm sure you'd love it too. Or do you want me to sing you a lullaby? I'm not as good as mom, but Milm liked it. Are you shitting me? No good, huh? Well, how about... I'll let you sleep on my lap. Something tells me this plan is not going to work. I will sew your lips together with Scent of Spiderweb if you don't shut your damn trap. Wait, I have an idea. I'll make Hundred Knight obey your orders. How about that? Hmm, uh, I don't know if I'm going to go along with this. Hmm... I don't really care about this doll, but I could use it for grunt work. I need to report to Eka Village for a witch hunting mission. So you obey that witch's orders until I come back. Occupa? But only three orders, okay? Three? And also, try to keep her from getting too angry. Her body is Milm's body. Don't let her mess it up. This is my body, you obnoxious cow. Now get out of my sight! I can't believe she heard that. Well then, Hundred Knight. I'll leave you to it. Thanks. Alright, very well. What? Thank you. It'll be hard to keep her happy, but you can do it. I don't know about that. What? Good. I'll be on my way then. Ugh. I wonder if there's any pain medicine around here. So, only three orders, huh? Cheapskate. Whatever. Alright, Hundred Knight. For my first order, find me a cloth to wipe this blood off. If you don't find me a cloth before this blood dries, I'll blow this entire castle to smithereens. <laughs> so, so how long have we got? Like five minutes? Like what? Yeah. Hmm? Ugh, I'm sick of waiting. I'm gonna follow it. Maybe you could communicate it through the flame on its head and it'll all be like, Occupa. Ah! Oh dear. What? You want to come too? Huh. <laughs> Do whatever you want, you deformed turkey. 
Part 1, Chapter 2 The Witch and the Holy Valkyrie No, again, again you got the name wrong. Oh. Ooh, what's this then? I'm clearly in a desert of some sort from looking at the distance. Is this some kind of witch's tower, maybe? Seems it. Oh, stage clear? Acquired Power Fortress Facet. Oh. Probably won't use anything different. Power Fortress excels in defense. It also has skills with wide areas of effect. So it's best to use best best used in group battles. However, it's very low resistance to magic, so be cautious against enemies that use magic. Again, it's like I didn't really use facets that much in the previous game. Maybe I will in this one. We'll see. Facets can only be changed at home. You can switch between equipped facets with L2 and R2. You can equip a maximum of three facets. Open the main menu with options. Try out all the facets and use ones you think best fit your strategy. That's why I'll probably stay with, with Wonder Knight. I think that's what it is. It's sort of very ba balanced, basically. Set facets. In set facets, you can switch out facets. At least select Power Fortress first. Next, select Wonder Knight. See that one? It's, I, I like that one. Not only do they look different, but the equipped aptitude and skills differ as well. So the facet best suited for the situation. I, ju I just like Wonder Knight in general. Ike. Ike? That's a new noise. Ike. 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 Really? Ike. Ike. Ooh, we can visit. Dag you. Dag you? What? In the store, you can buy and sell equipment and items. As you progress through the store, any new items will be stocked. Well, alright then. Now we know what it is. That's all I wanted to really know, really, was what the hell was this? Right, so, there doesn't seem to be any shinies around. That was something. Wait. Didn't want to interrupt. How far are you planning to go for just a lousy piece of fabric? Quite far. I told you. If this blood dries, I'm gonna blow up this whole castle. So it's pretty much go buy some cloth from the shop. Is what you're saying. So I can't go that way, because it's blocked. So it's the shop. Hi. Clearly. Thank you. Thank you. Buy item. No? No. Oh. Where am I where am I gonna go then? Where? Hi. Where's I get cloths? Yeah. I smash stuff. Where I get? Can I go back inside? Uh, use? Oh, I see. What's inside here then? Uh, which guidebook? Oh, it's just the tips. Atelier. About the atelier. In the atelier, you can strengthen weapons and armor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to use all this stuff. It's just, it's basically like an atelier, oddly enough. Bedroom. Come on, then. Why are you going to the bedroom? I don't need sleep. I could stay awake for two months if I wanted to. So no sleep for you either. Oh, but I'm tired. Yeah. If you've got a problem with that, I'll help you sleep forever. Uh, 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 gladly, I think. Maybe it depends how you mean that. Now hurry up and find that cloth. All right. Jeez. Go again? The hall? There's a little, little, like, teddy there. It's very cute. So, this is the room where the obnoxious cow and her sister play house. I'll use this as my base of operations for commanding my Manania army. Starting with you. If I don't blow this place up first, of course. Of course. <laughs> what? Is that a bird? There it is. It's a raven chick. I don't know where it got in from, but it covered my room in crap. Hey, Hundred Knight, I've got my second order for you. Already? 
clean up all the bird shit, then toss this raven outside. Aw, what? What? Oh. Oh. Still waiting for an occupier. 100 Knight cleaned the room as ordered and returned the baby raven to the nest that was outside. Jeez, you're slow. This blood is gonna dry. I'm working on it. If you don't want this castle blown up, you better find me a cloth. I'm working on it. Jeez. So, I'll, I'll try go backing in. Go backing in first. Basement! Research lab. Ooh. Is this a research lab? I don't like it. Too organized. Witches should be working in chaos. A room of anarchy. Thank you. 109 found a large cloth. There we go. It was a bit dirty and covered in dust. What do you want? Oh, a cloth? Sorry, but you were a bit too late. The blood's already dry. Kaboom, I guess. As soon as I'm done cleaning this blood, I'm going to sink this castle into the swamp. Oh, so there is a swamp. Okay. Yeah. Mm, there. That'll do it. Don't need this anymore. Hey, it's gone. Hundred Knight, where are you? It's an invisibility cloth. What? What is this? Give me that! I sense magic in this fabric. Is it some kind of invisibility spell? Hmm. Hmm? Oh, this is... I see. Thank you. Seems this place has some valuable information for me to plunder. <laughs> Interesting. Maybe I won't destroy this castle after all. I'll bide my time, enhance my power, and take everything for myself! I mean, it's a better plan? Huh? I don't have any use for you. Shoo! Go away. No, wait. That'd be too boring. I'll give you my third order. Bring the strongest enemy you can find to me. The strongest? Not some worthless minion. I mean a really dangerous bastard. Someone equal to me. Or even stronger. If that's even possible. You know what'll happen if you disobey me, right? I suggest you get moving. Oh, very well. Car? We got, we got nothing left to visit in here? Basement. Gonna have to go back to the basement straight away. <laughs> Perfect! I'll test it on that stupid turkey. It? Huh? You? I thought you left. You thought wrong! Wait a minute. You don't even know where to go? Seriously? Well, it's not like I know the lay of the land. Oh? Jeez, you really are just a puppet. Is your brain stuffed with straw or something? That obnoxious cow said something about an awakened witch, didn't she? If you follow her, I'm sure you'll find someone worth fighting. Maybe not. Got it. Now hurry up! Alright, uh, is there anything else in here? Nope, right, so we can finally head off. Alright, so, skip. Boom, we're there. I like that. It's like we've seen it once. Oh, we can actually... Oh, what's, so what's this way, then? If we can go that way, what's this way? Uh, that's the Misty Forest, then, so, no. So this has got to be the world map, right? Ooh. That may as well do this. Now use the power of mana, activate. Or between mana plants. Well, there we go. So we want to go there, don't we? 
Right, so it is back to the Misty Forest. Okay. So that's what that was. Uh, Misty Forest. Uh, yes. Tip 29. Kivala. A ten hut! Form up, men! My... God, you're amazing. Look at the- look at your design. You've got like a robotic arm. You've got like half a goggle. Is the best way of putting it. Like it's, it's like some kind of like eyepiece. And you're carrying around a coffin. This is, which is some kind of mallet as well. I, I, your design is brilliant. It's just, just amazing. Yes, ma'am! Outstanding. Prepare to die. What? Yes, ma'am! What? Leave your wills with me, Zophie. Refuse a life of shame. Die with honor. You're Zophie? Yes, ma'am! At ease. Prepare to be briefed on Operation Blue Viper. Our target is the awakened Witch Isabel. Our mission is to secure a perimeter and draw the target into our kill zone after Gabrielle's unit presses them there. When the target enters our ambush point, the east and west flanks will pincer inwards. That's when we deploy the Flash Firefly. The what? As you all know, our target possesses a third eye, which can drive one insane. But if it's blinded, we don't have to worry about that problem. The Flash Firefly will last for three minutes. During that time, the unit positioned upwind will charge and pin down the target. You've all endured sleepless nights for over a year in preparation for this day. Even in the blinding light, you shouldn't be affected. When the target is in close quarters, inject the magic parasite. At that time, Gabrielle and I will engage. Oh, I see. So it was them who put the parasite in Chelka. Got it. Well, middle, but you know. With the target subdued, I will use my grave hammer to seal their magic away and complete the mission. But remember, even without her poison or her third eye, Isabel is still a formidable witch. So I'll repeat myself. Today, you march into the jaws of death, and I will bury your bones myself. Okay. Yes, ma'am! You're filling me with confidence. That is all. Okay. Indeed. Amanania! Out of my way. <laughs> A pathetic underling. Linda? You weren't even good for a warm up. Commence operation. Secure the perimeter. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am! Indeed. Sorry I'm late. Huh? I thought the head Holy Valkyrie was supposed to be here. Right in front of you. That's me. I'm Zophie. What? Hmm. You were thinking to yourself... It couldn't possibly be this kid, weren't you? No, I, 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 well, me myself, I was thinking quite the opposite, to be honest. Like, you're incredible. No, uh, well, yes, I was. But you didn't have to punch me. Quit whining. I'm already 14. If you treat me like a kid again, you're dead. Yes, ma'am. She'd kill me just for that? She's terrifying. I don't know if I can work under a commanding officer like that. I, I, I just find her amazing. I mean, look at her hair. Zophie, everything is in place. Understood. Amelie, I heard that Rope Branch was destroyed. But what about your sister? I couldn't find her. Oh, is that right? What happened? I don't know. 
The building was already destroyed when I got there. Could it have been Isabel? No. We've had her under constant surveillance. If she was going to make a move, we would know. It could be Prim. That would spell trouble for us. Prim, you say? Still, what's done is done. No sense worrying about it now. Road Branch will have to wait. We need to focus on the mission. Amelie, are you okay? Oh, yes! If something's weighing on your mind, you should excuse yourself from this mission. We can't afford to have you weigh us down. No, please let me stay. I have to do something. Isabel is the sworn enemy of my family. I want to take her down with my own two hands. I will take her down. Hmm, fine. That Manania we just saw now is Isabel's pet, right? The next time it appears, take care of it. Understood. I have to prove myself here if I want to become a Holy Valkyrie. Once I'm a Holy Valkyrie, I will have access to the knowledge I need to cure Milm's witch disease. That's assuming it can actually be cured. I hate to have to betray the Vice Ritter. They're good people who help total strangers like me and Milne. No, if I can defeat Isabel, I'll be repaying my debt to the Vice Ritter. Yes, that's it. Then everything will be okay. It won't. Ow! The pain reliever isn't working. I gotta do something. Oh, tip 23, the best tip, of course. Of course, spears are low attack weapon. All right. Right, so we're going to end this part here, and in the next part, we'll make our way through the Misty Forest. So we'll see you then. Ta-ta for now.